You're not perfect, Sarah. Who's perfect? I dare you to bring out the real you. Because we haven't seen her yet. What? And everybody's waiting to see who you really are. What the f is this? What the f is this? I f***ing adore this girl. And I'm very disappointed in how I felt like she judged me I did not, in my own home. I did not judge Sarah, you. Sarah, whether valid or invalid, Sarah, I felt that way. It hurt my feelings, OK? I did not say you're not affectionate. I said show more. I'm pushing you but to But you don't more. need to tell me that. I don't need your advice on that. I, but, I'm the way I am for a reason, Sarah. You said go tuck him in yourself and all that. Let, let me Sarah, tell you. hurt me, OK? Let me tell you I swear on my son's life. I said, Caroline, tuck him in. I'll stay here with them. Don't worry. That's what I said. I did not say, Caroline, go tuck him in. Somehow. And, and maybe I missed maybe, something. Maybe, maybe. Wait, let me just be yeah. easy, because it's a little bit tough. Maybe we both misunderstood each other, Sarah. That comment that you made hurt me. And instead of tucking your I, kid in? Everything. Sarah always wants to encourage us to take accountability for our actions. You know, you need to dig deep in your soul because, oh, haram, like, let it out. Sarah, you made a mistake. You're being very judgmental. She's not owning it, and I don't respect that. I get it. Okay, I get I get you're hurt, but this shows that hey, something gorgeous triggered Hey, gorgeous girls. Hey, I came to hi. join you guys because join us. I wanted to just tell you that the dinner is starting. Best celebration ever. I'm saying to your mom, you've got a really good man who loves you, respects you. Love you. Thank you for coming. Did you tell her that you were not judging her? No, I don't know. Because if you felt to judge, maybe you should tell her I wasn't judging you. I told her. Please Caroline. sit with me. Yeah. So Caroline, this is decades of raising, yes. of a parenting, of culture. Okay. And I raised my son in a way that I know is right. You should raise your son the way you want to raise your son. That is absolutely and true. I, but, but, no, but she's spoke not about saying, the way she raised her yeah, son. But we she's never not saying that she that. judged you. But that's my opinion, right? Yeah, because when you called me, you felt as though she was basically judging you from I your, really from your judged. perspective. Yeah, I felt but, really right? judged. But, but her friend. I'm going to go home. She took the whole constructive conversation out of context, remixed it, twisted it, and now she makes me look bad. This is all bullshit. not on my clock. Your tribe determines your vibe, and that's not the kind of vibe I want in my life. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, no, I'm going let's home. go to the party. No, I'm going home. No, Caroline, let's go. I'm let's going home. No. You're never overreacting when it comes to your children. Sarah should just apologize if that's not how she meant it, and then Brooke should never show up to any event intoxicated. Let's go. When black people invite you to their house, sit down, eat, and leave us the hell alone. Don't tell us how to raise our kids. Let's go, guys. Let's go. I'm in charge, I'm in charge, I'm in charge. But down, you gon' respect me. Step back now, don't you test me. So nice! Look at the Randy! So cute! I wish the kids were here. Honey, I'm so sorry. It's been so much things going on. I didn't see you at all. I didn't see you. Come sit next to me. I'm so hungry. It's beautiful, eh, honey, no? I love you, Nikki's. Oh. I'll record it for you. I would want someone to capture this. Me and Sergio, we've been through so much. Congratulations, eh? Thank you. We're here, and we're here to stay, and I think it's just so nice to have this amazing party. You can't help but smile. Everybody's having a good time. Everybody. Ale, papi, ale! I love you. So happy you're here. Sergio and I have been going back and forth with seating plans. You know, I guess I won. Are you okay with it? Yeah, I mean, I'm okay with it now, you know, not having my family there. It was just not how I was expecting my, let's say, pre-wedding party, because I wanted to be with my family, but they were just behind me very close and everybody was happy. And actually, I had my best friend in the table with my future wife. Where's Brooks? <laughs> I have no She idea. was up there, girl, it was drama. I know, I walked away. I'm ready to go. Mm -hmm. Yeah, over it. Sir, you're not innocent. 
you know exactly what you said. You were trying to be a therapist, which you don't have the credentials for, and now it all caught up to you. This is where everything is about to go left. All right, never mind, it's Now enjoy. That's what you're talking about. Time to work, my friend. Did you see? She came as me to the f***ing wedding. She came in a veil, in a blonde wig. Who the f*** does that? You're a fake job in time, Stop listening, you f***. So many people have asked me about Ian's dress that it's just a joke to me. Are you me? I will never be you, Annie, because you're better than me. Everyone saw you arrive, OK? And they thought it was me. And we I'm don't. like, I'm a black woman. How can you be me? Okay, because you can't have us. You look like me. Okay? I'm trying to fig I'm trying to figure out she's getting married. Oh, okay, you know what? It's enough of this bullshit from everybody. First of all, say hello. I wanted to come and say hello. hello. No, I said I see you before. No, I'm Juliet. I'm Ian. Nice to meet you. She's spicy. Yes, exactly. She thinks this is normal. Are like you a beast? You look like a wedding dress, girl. No. Chanel, you have a train. I was told to wear white, honey. It's not my problem if I outstage the bride. The bride knows I'm coming. I always look good. Has nothing to outstage the bride. I just always look good. Love you, it's okay. I swear to God, you I don't look like a bride. You look like the bride. 